Alrighty, Tartar bitches, it's your boy Dead at the motherfucking zombie up in this bitch. I decided to say fuck it and uh, do a misery re uh, review. Um, there's a, a couple projects he had up on his old website, which was, I think, misery2012.com at, at the time. And um, he, he had two albums up for free download on the merch page, I think. One of them was called Love Hate, which was an unreleased project, and the other one was the, I'm going to chop this up, but Puerto Rican Day Parade album or something like that. Um, th this is one of those albums I'm reviewing the Love Hate project. It's only nine tracks long, and I've been bumping the shit out of it all goddamn day. I gave at least a good three, four <laughs> listens to it while I was out doing uh, yard work. So I said, fuck it. Um, it's a good fucking project. Uh, nine tracks. Speaking of tracks, let's dive in into those real quick. We got the Miz intro, Witching Hour, the remix. 9mm featuring Mars, former Dark Lotus Mars. My Life, Got Those, What What, Love to Love You, It Is What It Is, and You Got It. Um, the first thing I gotta say is the Witching Hour remix. Holy fuck, is it dope. Um, the B on, on the, the remix is more sludgy, if that's a word. It's more grimy than the original. The original one was more horror, horror hip hop based, more horrorcore based, because you know it had ICP on it and shit. And I love both versions. This one's a good version, a good version to smoke to. Another great track is a uh, um, nine millimeter featuring Mars. Now you can tell this is an old project, or all these tracks are unreleased because this is when Mars was still. Talking about that gangsta shit. <laughs> so that's how I know it's an all project because Mars is like all about Christianity or something. Now. Which, hey, you know, I'm not gonna knock a guy first hustle, you know. You do you, and it shouldn't bother me any because it doesn't. Um, yeah, so, uh, my third favorite track has to be, uh, My Life. My life forgot those. Uh, one of these tracks is a, um, actually two of them is like a, a club track, which I think is Got Those and You Got It. Both those are kind of like more drinking oriented tracks, more party oriented, more smoking, you know. Good shit though. I was not disappointed with this. Um, I checked the site last night to see if the project was still up there for free download and I couldn't see it anywhere. So, I ain't got no idea where you guys can find this, but, um, might have to do a little bit of digging on the internet, but, you know, <laughs> if you're a big Misery fan like I am, you're gonna love this project, uh, or if I'm, or if I feel like it, I will leave a, a media fire link or a zippy share link down below to this project. I recommend this shit highly. I give this that's this old, old school misery um I'm gonna give it a 4 out of 5 3.75 to 4 out of 5. Eh, no, 4. 4. I think that's good. This is a great fucking project. This dope shit. Um I think that's it, y'all. Um Sideshow EP review Beverly Kills 501 87 coming Sunday or Monday still. Um, if you're a fan of Misery, tell me what your favorite project is by him. Um, I'm gonna try to cap that Parala Isla 20th anniversary edition if they still get hard copies of it. If they do, then yes! If they don't, then alright, y'all. I'm out this piece. Whoop whoop. Much clown love, and well, as I said, I'm out.